well folks I just hit the jackpot this caved in on me and before it caved in I raked a bunch of stuff up out of it and I don't know if you can see this but you marble guys are gonna go look at this marble down here I already picked it up and cleaned it off it's a handmade huge shooter marble that's made out of one of the glass rods and it's over a hundred years old and it's just magnificent look at this folks it's got the ground panels on the end let me get this cleaned up a little bit this is just a showstopper folks it's just oh i don't know if you can see this but look at this folks oh man well anyway i'll clean it up here later all right folks well this is the best marble you can see the ground panels on the end this is the best marble from this dump. That's just a stain. There's the other ground panel. It's an old handmade marble. Oh man, this is nice. Uh, they call them like onion skins or... It's just awesome, folks. Oh, this is a day maker. Well, anyway, I'll get this down in the thing and I'm gonna keep going here. I got a token and this in just like five minutes here in this spot later. All right, um, the pictures weren't showing the real color of this marble. You can see it there. You can see why they call these onion skins. Looks like an onion on the tip. But it's got reds, greens, yellows. And it's just, oh, it's got bubbles in it. Look at that swirl there. This is a handmade German marble. I would guess that this dates to the 1880s. Um, it's shooter size and it's awesome. I can't believe I found this today. It was slow going and I just stuck with it. There was lots of German immigrants in this county where I was digging on this dump. Look, man, look at that red there. And that, oh, this is nice. And if I had this, if I had to sell this, I wouldn't let it go for less than 50 or $60. And I would guess running it auction style, um, knowing that it was found on video and where I found it that it would get more than that you can look at them on ebay guys that want 250 dollars for some of these and this one's flawless it's an excellent find i can't believe it these are the kind of marbles i collect so this is going right in my collection um haven't found one for a while but look at that wow it's nice that's where it was th this is a hand blown marble like handmade and that's where they snipped it off and some grinding you can see how they twisted the rod there and i'll put up information but that's a good look at it this is you know way over 100 years old one of the first glass marbles ever manufactured and it's handmade probably in germany by a guy that's long dead and played with by people that are long dead there's magic to stuff like this Anyway, later, folks.